11 Tricks No Waiter Will Tell You About. Restaurant owners care not only about your coming to their place again, but also about you ordering dishes they want you to. Today, we're going to tell you about usual tricks that restaurant managers use to make you spend more. Have you ever heard about aroma marketing? Well, this method actually works wonders, and we're going to explain to you how and why. Number 11, a menu where everyone can find something to their taste. Have you noticed there are vegetarian dishes in almost every cafe? The choice is often made so that no one leaves hungry. For instance, every menu has something trendy, something nutritious for those who want to eat, something light for those who don't eat much, and so on. Number 10, music inside. When there's luxury music playing in the background, you can eat much more than when there's no music at all. For example, classical music makes clients spend 10% more, and all because their self-esteem rises, and they see themselves wealthier and more prominent. Music can also be adjusted for particular purposes. French Chanson is best for selling wines, and Irish Folk is perfect for beer. Number 9, 10% price increase. Most clients won't mind if they have to pay 7 to 10% more than they planned. That's why sauces and other additions in fast food joints usually cost no more than 10% of the cost of a dish. Number eight, compact menus. Too many dishes on a menu confuse clients. Restaurant consultant Aaron Allen says that by overloading the menu, you torture guests, making them dissatisfied with their visit because they doubt if they made the right choice. People also tend to think that a restaurant can't cook so many dishes well. That's why the best menu is often one that's written on a single sheet. Number seven, positive attitude of the waiters. Waiters know the clients appreciate it if you start a conversation with a friendly comment, even if it's only about the weather. Tips usually increase by a third as a result of such a simple trick. Number six, a restaurant's legend. The aim of a legend is to make the restaurant stand out from the crowd. A simple example, one cafe has a pastry chef who knows the secret of unique Polish donuts, while another cafe simply makes donuts. A lot of guests won't just go to the former, but will say afterward that they liked that one's donuts better. Number five, an extra offer. You've probably noticed how when you order a coffee, your waiter asks a large one and nods approvingly. By the time you realize you've agreed to something not originally on your mind, it's already too late. Besides, Double portions are often called standard, and standard ones are small, which also increases the income. Number four, using the chef's reputation. The reputation of a chef is a powerful thing. Any dish that is the chef's specialty will stand out in the guest's eyes not to mention when it is served by the chef, him or herself. Sometimes, waiters even dress up as the chef and play the role before the clients. Number three, aroma marketing. Smells always affect our minds. Even if we have a strict plan, aromas may well adjust it. 
vanilla and cinnamon fragrances increase the sales of desserts. While the smell of bacon makes people order more for breakfast. Lavender is often used to make guests relax, stop hurrying, and spend more. Number two, getting rid of dirty dishes. Waiters always try to dispose of your empty plates as soon as possible. Of course, it's not too pleasant to sit at a table full of dirty crockery. But there's another reason too. This way, the guests won't think they've ordered too much. If there were a growing heap of dishes, they'd stop sooner. Number one, waiters' odd money manipulations. Waiters have their own tricks to get bigger tips. They may take their time bringing you the change in the hope you'll give it up and leave. Or they bring you changing coins or dirty bills so that you don't want to touch it. Actually, such tricks are considered cheap and are not used at decent places. Do you know any other tricks that restaurants use to fool us? Share them in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button below the video and click subscribe to stay on the bright side of life.